Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna to be showing you guys how to get two easy slick bun hairstyles. So I love wearing a bun, you guys. Not only when I don't feel like doing my hair, but I just love the sleekness of it. And I don't know, I just feel like when, I'm, when my hair is pulled back, I just look better. I feel like you can see my bone structure, honey, these cheekbones. But so if you guys are interested in seeing how I do this on my fine texture hair, um, of course, just keep on watching. My hair is straightened right now and it's dirty, so it's a lot easier, but I can also do this video when my hair is curly and thick. So let me know if that's something you guys wanna see. Um, but yeah, if you guys wanna see how to get two sleek options for your bun, of course, just keep on watching. Okay, you guys, so for this video, all you're going to need is a comb. This is the comb that I use. So you're gonna need a comb, a brush. This is the one that I use and a detangling brush or a, what do you call this? A, um, I don't know, you need a brush like this. And you're gonna need some gel. And normally I would use a water bottle, but because my hair is straightened, um, at the moment, I don't need any like to wet it because I can pretty much slick it down. If my hair was curly and thick, um, I would need water to kind of help lay my hair flat. All right, so I'm gonna start by brushing out my hair. I just did a look for my Instagram. That's why I have on this makeup and I had, it was super cute. Um, so I'm just gonna brush all my hair to the back just because I wanna start off, hi, my dog is right here. I wanna start off with my hair um, in a middle part. So when I, normally when I do my ponytail or my bun, I like to have a middle part. So I'm just gonna, and I'm using my viewfinder as my mirror. Um, I'm just going to middle part my hair and you guys, I cannot part to save my life okay okay so i'm looking over here because i have my mirror over there um so yeah i cannot part to save my life but i get i get the job done is that straight enough you just want to try to make it and this part of the comb does not help like i still suck so But whatever, for me, it doesn't have to be like super perfect, just my hair is dirty right now. So if you see any flakes, then that's why. All right, so obviously you're going to need some hair ties, girl. So I have three here because I like my bun to be um, tight. Now, normally when I wear my bun, it's probably when my hair is curly because I like to have like a thick bun, but this will be okay. Um, for the video so what i'm gonna do is and because my hair is oily it's making it a lot easier i'm gonna take my brush and slick my bun or slick my hair down and this is obviously i have fine hair right now because like i said it's straightened hair and it's dirty hair so i'm just gonna take my brush but it really does. It really. It's not hard for me to use when I when my hair is um, curly. But okay, so I'm gonna take my hair tie, and I like to have my buns low. So you want your bun to like be right here at the top, at the bottom of your at the top of your neck. I don't like mine to be high or anything. So I'm going to do my rubber band. Hopefully my. I got a headache too, you guys, so I probably don't need to do it too, too tight. Okay, so once I have it in a ponytail, I would go in with my gel. This is the Aunt, Jack, Aunt Jackie No, or Don't Shrink Gel. And I'm gonna just take what's in the cap. <laughs> Slick my hair down. You know? Give me like two seconds to do. That's why I love doing this hairstyle. And then I just take my brush again and slick it back. 
Okay, so then with the remaining two rubber bands, what I'm gonna do is, so this is what the ponytail looks like. And um, basically what I'm gonna do is flip my hair. Let me turn around so y'all can see. I basically just flip my hair around like so. And I like it, I like it to where some of my hair is still falling out of the bun and I like a messy bun, okay? So then I do two or three rubber bands and this is what it ends up looking like. Like that. And you guys, I seriously love this. A lot of people love when I wear my hair pulled back. I think it's because they can see like my face structure. So yeah, this is one of the buns that I like to do. And sometimes I will do my baby hairs, but um, for the sake of right now, I'm not going to do that because I'm going to show you guys one other style that I like to do as well. So let's get to that one. Okay, so for the second bun, I'm going to brush my hair back again because I'm going to change the part. I use, now this style of bun I used to wear more like when I was younger, when I was in high school. Um, I don't really wear this a lot now because I don't like hair like in my face or like I don't like to wear a swoop too often because the products in my hair can make my face break out and girl, ain't nobody got time for that. So, but that's what I'm gonna show you guys. So what I do is start like where the arch of my brow is And this is like what I would call a deep part bun. So basically, I'm just gonna lay all my hairs down and do, you know, like a swoop. And so what I'm gonna do is take my comb and depending on how low you like your swoop, it's up to you. Like I said, I don't necessarily like a lot of hair on my forehead, um, in my face, or in my face. So I just kind of leave mine, you know, here, this length. Okay, so um, this is how this one is looking so far. So I'm going to take a rubber band and again, um, pull out, I mean, not pull out, rub, oh my God, what am I saying? Tie the hair at the top of my neck for a low bun, okay? So before I go in with anything else, I, when I wear this bun, I like to pull out some hairs. This is optional obviously you don't have to do this i like to do this just because i feel like it gives you know like just it adds a little bit to i don't know i just like to do it so then i'm going to take some more of my gel i also like the shining jam um like gel and i'm going to place the gel along here um and i'm gonna take my comb and I'm gonna lay out my baby hairs. So I just take it and I brush them down. And then I just Basically, however you like to wear your baby hairs, I'm actually gonna, yeah, I'm gonna pull these back. However you like to do your baby hairs is up to you. Okay, so now that I have 
my hair slick. I'm going to um, twist my hair, you know, and I'm going to actually twist it around. Okay, and then I'm going to take another one to tighten it. And that's basically how I do my buns, you guys. And right now it's a little bit harder because I did cut my hair shorter length, as you guys can see. So it is a little bit harder to get like a full bun. But for me, when I don't feel like doing my hair, but I want something cute and that will kind of you know stand out girl this is what i do i love 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 wearing my bun so i hope you guys enjoyed or learned something enjoyed and learned something from this video if you did give it a thumbs up comment down below and let me know what you guys want to see next thank you for watching and i'll see you in my next one